Odds are you've heard all the new rave about the new weight loss medications like Ozempic, Manjaro, and Wagovi. Well, there's a new medication on the block that's blowing all three of these out of the water, and that's what we're here to talk about today. Make sure to stick around to the end of this video to see if you could qualify for this new medication. In the last few days, the generic medication known as Terzepatide has now been FDA approved for obesity only, and it falls under the brand name known as Zepbound by Eli Lilly. It comes in multiple dosages of 2.5, 5, 7.5, 10, 12.5, and 15 milligrams. And the results that this medication is showing are absolutely staggering. This medication was approved by having two well done studies known as Surmount 1 and Surmount 2. These two studies were randomized, double blinded, and placebo controlled, and they consisted of thousands of people all across the world. At the end of these trials, people on the highest dose of the medication lost on average, get this, an average of over 50 pounds. That's insane. And what's even crazier than that is that nearly one third of all the participants between the two trials lost over 25% of their entire body weight. There's no medication out there with similar results to this. And honestly, the only thing that comes close that we have today is bariatric surgery. So in just a few months, we're going to have medications that have similar outcomes and yield similar results to that of bariatric surgery without all of the potential life altering complications that every surgery has. So how does this medication actually work and what makes it so good for weight loss? Well, terzepatide is the generic name for the two brand name medications of Manjaro and Zepbound. This medication contains a molecule that imitates two major hormones. The first hormone it imitates is known as GLP-1, which is actually the same hormone that's imitated with medications like Ozempic and Wagovi. This hormone sends a signal to the brain letting your body know that you are full and it is time to stop eating, so you end up eating less food than you normally would. The second hormone that this medication mimics is known as GIP, which not only reduces appetite in a similar mannerism, but also may help the body break down fats and sugar more efficiently. These two hormones together create a synergistic effect that helps augment and facilitate even more weight loss. So how do you know if you actually qualify for this medication? Well, the eligibility criteria are as follows. You need to have a BMI greater than 30 or your BMI needs to be higher than 27 with another weight related condition, such as high blood pressure, sleep apnea, or heart disease. Zepbound will only be FDA approved for those individuals 18 and older, and it will be available for doctors to start prescribing come December of this year. So what are some potential side effects or drawbacks of this new medication? Because it kind of sounds too good to be true. Well, the biggest, and I would say most limiting factor to getting this medication is the cost. It's about 20% less expensive than Wagovi is, but it still costs an individual about $1,000 a month without insurance. But there is good news. Because it is now FDA approved for obesity only, there's a good chance that more and more insurance companies will pick this up and cover the medication to reduce cost. A lot of the major side effects with Zepbound are similar to that of Wegovi and Ozempic, and it really causes a lot of stomach problems such as nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and belly pain. However, these side effects are quite mild and don't happen with a lot of individuals, and they tend to go away with prolonged use of the medication. Thanks for watching this video, guys, and as always, I'll catch you all on the next one.